Okay. All right. We're back. We have a new overlay. Um, and uh, ready to play some chess. I did take a couple of days off. Um, so I might be rusty. We'll have to see, I guess. <laughs> but we're gonna just dive right in. Um, we're eleven fifty-one, which is really close to our high. Let's see. I'm actually curious. I forget. I did this last time. Um, no, it is our high. Sick. All right, so we are literally at our peak, so I expect to go on an epic losing streak. That'll be fun. Um, let me move this a little bit. Okay. <clears throat> so let's see how it goes. Let's just jump right into it. Let's see if we start with white pieces or black pieces. Who knows? It could be anything. It could be anything. I guess just it could just be white or black. It's not gonna be like blue, but you know. All right, we are black pieces. We're gonna play our Sicilian defense. Okay, this is a weird version of it, but I know people do this. Just forces the queen to move. Um, I don't. This is also strange to me, but you know. Okay, we are just going all in, which is <laughs> fine, I guess. I'm. Uh, I mean, if he takes and I take, it's just nothing has happened. Which is what's going to happen here. So I'm not really sure what what's happening. Um, yeah. Not really sure. So... Yep. I mean, even a push here, I can just leave. Hey, this creates, I guess, somewhat of a problem. Not really, actually, not really. If he moves here, I can just take. Even if he were to move here and I didn't take and he took, and I took back this way, there's like, like he's got to move. I, I, I don't get it. So I'm just not going to stress about this at all. I'm going to pretend it's not happening. And just not care, because it's pretty irrelevant. Um, so if I go here, we're probably going to get taken. We're going to go like this. Then probably our next move is to reinforce it with this. So that kind of locks our... Our bishop in, but um, I mean, the other option is to come here and try and push this bishop off. <clears throat> and I mean, the bishop would have to kind of go here, or I could just take. But then what happens? Let's say I go here, and the bishop goes here. I guess I can come here to go here. It's a very interesting... Let's give it a shot. I'll keep putting pressure on the on the position and see how it sort of plays out. Oh, well, pfft, you're stupid. You're literally an idiot. This is what happens when I don't play chess in a while. Okay, cool, nice. I'm proud of myself, that was really good. I'm amazing. What's my ELO? My ELO is obviously shit, man. It's, um, it's not on screen. No, it is. It's up here. 11.51 right now. Um, you know, generally trash. Um, generally just trash. <laughs> All right. So that is not something we're going to let happen, obviously. <clears throat> um...
I'm actually okay with this push. Oh, it seems weird because he can take, but it... okay. So I mean, that's bad, I guess. But I think the truth is, I'd rather him take, so I can take. Um. I mean, here he's going to have to take this way. Okay. Still down the piece because I'm an idiot, but I mean, it's not like end of the world type scenario. It's just uncomfortable. It's bad, I'm not gonna lie. I fucked this up. Can you not hear me? I was talking to you, Merlin Gold. Merlin God. Um, I'm sorry if you didn't hear my response. I literally answered you. Um, I'm not sure what the point of that is. Um, is my, I wonder if my, no, my mic's working just fine, so I don't know, I don't know what it is. And I can do this, make him move. And I'm just going to take this, well, if I, okay, so if I take this and he moves this here, where can I go? I can go here. I can't get out that way. If I take this and he goes here, I can't can't go there. I kind of have to just go back and come back down. Okay. I accept that. I feel like I need to try and win everything I can at this moment. Interesting. Not what I was expecting. Uh, I mean, I guess he's going to try and check me and have me go like this and lose the rook. But if he comes here and I move here. He can come here move here that's basically mate I can just go like this and go back and forth but nothing is guarding this at this point I think that would be the, the fear So if I move, okay, if I move here now, and he checks, I can just come here, or I can go here. I can't go here, because he can check. Well, I can. He can check me, and then I can just come up here, scare him away, or be safe. Yeah, I'm going to do this. He can just take this pawn, of course. Which is what he chooses to do. Um, just 
which is fine, I guess. I think this is fine. I think this is okay. I mean, it's not okay because we're down a piece, right? But it's like, okay. Because I think we win this. And we keep pressuring this knight. He doesn't have a whole lot of places to go. Um... That doesn't give me a whole lot of things to do. Hmm. Obviously, that's not an ideal scenario. It's kind of uncomfortable. But it's not the end of the world. If he comes out here... That would be super shitty. But if I line these up... I think the best I can do is... Probably... Guard this piece. Guard that pawn. But he can push me off so easily, yeah. That's the the problem with that. It's interesting because we're just kind of going back and forth after each other's piece, their pawns, for seemingly no reason. Um, it's weird that he's just trying to get me to move. Like, this just seems like a one move threat. I guess he can take this, right? So it's not just a one move threat, it's actually kind of annoying. If I take this, I'm guarding that pawn, though. I'm guarding everything here. I should be fine. Because this is pinned, right? So I can't take back. So that's a, that's a threat. That's a, a, a theoretical threat. Um... And if he wants to force a trade here, I can take his take his knight back. Okay, I'm running out of time. Ah, I lost. Fuck! How did I let myself do that? I got really bad at the end. I didn't know what I was doing. Um, and that's kind of my fault. So, we're 0 and 1. Oh, man. I deserved that shit. <laughs> this is what happens when I don't play for like five days and focus on other things. Um, I get, I get, I get crap. Get garbage. All right, we're 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 a little bit angrier. <laughs> All right, let's play a little more seriously this time. <sighs> Not blunder pieces. That's kind of important. All right, standard Italian. Um, gonna just castle. Cover our pawn. Um, just 
go like this. It's no big deal. Totally fine by me. Next thing we do is kick this knight out. And now we actually don't have to use this pawn. Um, which is kind of interesting. If he takes, we can take and undouble, and then we can support it. On the other hand, if he doesn't take, I guess this pawn isn't supported anymore, right? Force him out and over here. And we come back and we support the piece or the, the pawn. Now, if he wants to push, we can, sorry, we can reinforce. Which I think I want to do anyway. Um, just to take away the, this option. It feels like he obviously wants to come here. And I obviously don't want him to do that. So, and that also opens up my ability to develop my knight. Um... <clears throat> Okay, we can just keep reinforcing, that's fine. You can just, you just reinforce all day. Um, another thing I'd like to do is move my, my king over one uh, to prevent any kind of like check shenanigans. That's not a straight line at all. Man, okay. So, fuck, a second ago I was hot, so I had my little space heater on, now I'm chilly. Um, I'm not sure what his plan is. I feel like he got his knights in a really, like, kind of awkward situation. I was trying to figure out a way through, um, which frankly is okay by me. Um... Now I want to know the best thing to do with my knight. This this feels natural, but I'm I'm actually not sure. If he takes here and I take back, and my knight is just hanging out. I mean, technically he can come here. Um but that's I guess that's not a threat, right? I I can cover it with five different things. It's certainly better than this move. It's probably better than that move. Which I don't know what I'm doing with my knight here. On the other hand, with my knight here, I am defending this pawn, and I can like let my queen move, or right, let my bishop move. Hmm. Yeah, I'm just gonna do this. Now my knights are defending each other. My queen and my bishop can be free. Um. I don't have to stress about it. This isn't a real threat um, at all. Uh, but I will move my king anyway, so that I'm not on the check line, just in case anything happens. I prefer not to be pinned. I did mention that earlier. I did not want to be pinned. He's putting a lot of pressure on the queen side, and I'm not really sure what the plan is there. Um, let's see, if I want to open this up, if it takes here, I can honestly just take back here um, at this point. That might be what I would do. This is now guarding these, and there's no pawn to kick me off. That does allow him to do this thing that I know he wanted to do, though. I think this can't be bad. If he takes here, I can honestly... I can choose what to take with. I'd probably take with my pawn, but... But, um... Yeah. 
Okay, I'm happy. I'm happy opening up the queen side if he wants to to work over there. I have enough pieces. As crazy as it sounds, I kind of want to push my king side, um, because his knight really, his knights don't really have anywhere to go. They'd be pushed back into nowhere, um, and give me the opportunity to start opening up some of these things. Um. Okay. So this pushes the queen either here or back. This is opening it up, which I was talking about wanting to do. I think I'm just going to open up. If he takes, we will probably take to be honest. So we're threatening the queen and the and the pawn, um, and everything's kind of covered, so we're okay with this, I think. If the queen moves on to the white line, it gives us even more power, because we can move and move back. Okay, this is a good move. Um, This, I feel like, helps me. As crazy as that sounds, because he's going to be able to take it. But it opens up my lines here. And I don't know what he's going to, what he's taking. Can keep just bullying the queen. Um, this is bad. If he takes, I take, he takes. We just trade. No, it's worse than just to trade, actually. Um, if I take this, he probably takes this. He's got that double covered right now. So I, I can't, I don't know if I can do anything about it. But I'm covering it here, so we'll just move back this way, and that's okay, I think. Fuck. This is a fork. And I didn't see it. I'm really happy that he also didn't see it. I don't want to lose my bishop, but, like, I'm glad he didn't see it. I feel like it's better to stay on this line here. 
Um, it prevents this knight from coming in. Uh, why is he kicking me out? Is there anything I need to be afraid of? If I take this, I'm threatening to take this. Or is she just moving his pieces? I'm not sure. <clears throat> right now I'm feeling un unconfident in my ability to make good decisions because I have not been making good decisions. So, um, feels not good. going back after this and we're also stopping the queen from hitting here <coughs> this also completely prevents the queen from really coming down here at all um, it's not just a queen trade I'm not sure I guess he's defending his bishop But I, th I think we take that, right? If I take this and he takes this way. And we come here to move this out. And if he comes here, then we move, we do, we do this. Okay, I'm okay with that. Even if he just comes this way, I'm okay. So now we do this. We're trying to get rid of this knight because it's annoying us. Which we have now done successfully, so that's good. So that's not a threat. He's basically offering a queen trade. Yeah, that's not, that's that's not a threat. If he moves this pawn, I can just move this up. Yeah. Nope, not a threat. Not concerned. I've deemed this. Okay, now it's a threat, right? Um, because if he takes it this way, yeah. If he comes in with this knight, I think we just trade the bishop. And we'd be okay with it. No, I'm really happy that we've moved our king out of the way. I'm really low on time, though. I did this last game. I need to not be low on time like this. So I need to start making decisions a little bit faster. Here, we're here. Here, we're here. Um... Okay, I don't know what that does. Here is a check, so we'll just... Um, how do we prevent that? We'll just go like this.
Ja. Oh. I'm just gonna be chill. We already know we take this. Um, he moves here, we just trade. If he can have my pawn, I'll take his pawn. Shit. Um, Fuck out, bro. Um, nice. I think my queen's trapped. My queen is trapped. Damn. Yeah. Oh, fuck! Dude. How do I not... How did this happen? How did this happen? They call it our losing streak. <laughs> we were fine. Okay, so we were slightly ahead until we made this move and then it was over. What, were, what did we need to do? Oh, fuck. That's really obvious. At this point, wait, this is a move? What are my choices? What could I have done? Analyze. What am I missing? Okay, so he goes like this, and we're even. So what am I supposed to do? E7. <laughs> oh my god i was like i'm fucking trapped god i'm so stupid it's so hard to be so dumb it's really painful it's like it's like you struggle to not be an idiot but then like <laughs> you're just a fucking idiot man chess will humble you in like a second all right all right let's play again that's fine these are warm-up games. I haven't played in five days. It's just normal warm-up games. All right, we have a Karakon. It's cool. Let's play some fantasy. Fuck. I played really well. I played like a 1400. I had like a 90% accuracy. I'm, I'm happy with how that went. I just... Um, 
like damn was not what I uh, was hoping for in terms of results obviously bruh Uh, I mean, that's kind of awkward. Um, I mean, I guess he wants to force, force queen trade. He can. That's fine. That doesn't... No skin off my back. I don't... I don't know why people do that. It feels really boring. It's a really boring way to play the, the beginning of the game. But, I mean... All right. Um, okay, all of this is fine. We just start, I think we just start bringing our king out a little bit. I mean, there's no queens on the board already, so we're in like a, not an end game, but like, it's like a pseudo something. Um, if we go here and he pushes and we come here, he's going here, we're going here, um, and we're actually in trouble because... Oh, no, we're not. This is still closed off. It just opens up our rook. So this is not a problem. Really, and uh, frankly, I think I think I'm okay with it. So... To think about it that way. Um, this is still a pretty strong pawn structure, so I'm not like worried about it. Though so that was a problem that I didn't really anticipate. I can come here, but then or I guess we're just trading. Yeah, and that's okay. It's not a big. It's not a big deal. It's not like an actual problem. It's like a first world problem. <laughs> You're like, man, I'd rather that not happen. But it did. Can't get in there. We could come in here. Um, but I don't know what that's accomplishing. Came back here and then we'd be just trading pieces for no reason. Wow, he's... um pushing everything at least there's a good imbalance with um bishop rook or bishop knight versus knight knight um i feel like that's uh better usually he's now just opened up this square so i can come here and when he moves i can come here and he can't even take so i'm kind of comfortable with that though i don't know what he'd be doing from here Probably there to trade me off. I don't know why he's trying to trade off so bad. Um, but this obviously forces the rook move. Um, yeah, frankly, I had just noticed when I said that, that if he had moved there, I could take this. Um, so I'm not surprised he didn't. Um, hmm. I don't want to give him unnecessary checks, but I do want to connect my, my rugs. Maybe I just want to push this. Nah, because if he does nothing, nah, that's kind of fucked. That also opens up his thing. Let's go back to our other plan of coming here. And I think that makes this more appealing, because now these are covering each other. Uh, what does it move like this? 
That's okay. Threatening this push up. I probably could have done that earlier. Um, last maneuver. Well, maneuver. Last move. Just to sort of keep him from castling. But I didn't. I didn't do it. <laughs> I didn't do it in time. So, you know, now we have what we have. This is covering this for that. This is covered by that. So, he can come here, here, and he can go back there. But, um,. Both of those are covered, but uh, so this moves this knight, and then I can move into this position. And the question is, do I like that position? Do I care about that position? <clears throat> it takes away the symmetry we we're just talking about, but I really don't like this bishop, if we're being honest. Um. Really, I think I'm going to do this. And then take this. And when he takes this, I'm going to move this. Okay. Um, that's fine. It's not like a long-term solution. But he comes in with a check, I just move here, and he basically has to move ba back, or I'm just going to take this and force this off, and then win a pawn. I think this is a pretty important pawn right now. Um, uh... What else am I seeing? This is a weird move. I can still come back up here. Here, I guess he's just thinking I can... He's going to take like this. Okay, so if he moves here... If I move here... I don't like that. That's going to end up bad for me, no matter how I look at it. I think we trade knight for bishop. I think we do that right now. <clears throat> I also want to have this pawn here. To prevent this jump. If he wants to trade to get there, I'm okay with it. Um, I don't think I really want to take. I just want to be there. I can do it with my, my king, but I'm afraid of my king being in this spot for too long. Because this push with this rook over puts me in a bad spot. Though I also don't hate this move, just pushing and making this rook like completely rock solid, like untouchable. So yeah, now he's trying to do that and that's uncomfortable. Um, so we have to go like this anyway. At least he can't double his rooks right now. So that's nice. I'm not tripling my pawns. That's just not happening. That's an insane, an insane idea. 
this locks my knight in place because this can take this off and that's like I get that but um now my knight doesn't have to move I think I just push these pawns up a bit. This is threatening that, which is an awkward thing to do, but I mean, that's what it's doing. This is a bigger threat. I think he's going to win this. The question is, what do I want to do about it? Um, from here, obviously he threatens this. This isn't a threat. That's not a threat. There's nothing else is really threatening, but I can, I can come here and sort of take this file. If he takes this, I can push up to this spot with my rook. And then he can't really move his knight. I can start taking his pawns. I'm happy with a rook trade here. That's an interesting decision. Um, I kind of want to just get this out, to be honest. I said a rook trade. I'm like thinking like a, I'm not thinking. This is the problem. I think that's the problem. I'm happy with a knight trade. I do want to get this knight out of this position. I'm down a pawn, but I don't think it's the biggest thing in the world. It's not fantastic for me, but. It's not disastrous either. Yeah, I mean, okay. I think we're in trouble now. He takes this. What do we do? Here. This forces the trade. Check, he moves, we come over here. Yeah? We have to take some of these. He's he's up too many pawns at this point. But I don't know that like trading rooks is gonna help me. Okay. 
That's not super bad for me, actually. If we're going to be honest, I don't hate what just happened. A slight... A slight majority on two sides is way better than... A huge majority everywhere. This is still vulnerable though, which I don't like. I need to kick this rook. But I don't know how. Oh no, what have I done? Game over. Man, I'm playing so bad. It's, <laughs> this is, this is awful. This is awful. We're really mad, we're really mad. Should we just not be playing chess right now? Like, what, what the fuck's the problem? Alright. We try again, I guess. This is, this is just... This is trash. Like, actual trash. Okay. I... I don't know. I don't know, man. Um, like, I see what he's going to do. Uh, it's really stupid. This is, a, this is a really stupid play. Um, I've seen this before. Where he's just trying to get his queen into this position. So I just, let me just put my bishop there. I don't care. Um, if I come here, if he takes, I can take. If I come here and he takes, I can take. Nah, I, I don't. He has too many defenders on it. I should still probably just take it, though. To be fair. Um, we can also just defend it this way. We'll defend the pawn. Okay. I don't understand. I don't get that. Don't get it. People like love the structure and it's just not that bad. I mean, I'm playing like shit, um, so I'm making everything look bad. But um it's it's just not that bad. Okay. Fine. This pawn is loose. I'm going to take this pawn.
Okay. Not sure what that did. Don't really care that much. Okay. I, okay. The next move is just to take this and take the rook. As long as you can't put a major threat on me. I might just move here. But, um... It's almost like he heard me. Alright, so where's he gonna go? Let's see. I think we just move here. Wait, it's a free piece. This is not a free piece? Kind of is. I'm confused. What's he doing? It's going to have to trade one for the other. Which is fine with me. This all feels fine with me. There's one extra pawn, but he's done a piece. What are his options? None of this. Fuck. I'm stupid. Now this is the move. So I, I lose the piece. It's fine. I'm down upon. Happens. This is what happens when your brain doesn't work. Just an idiot. Yep. Push him away. It really has to go like pretty far away, I think. No! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Fuck! I am. I am like. We're furious. Wow. Wow. This should not be playing on the Tesla. Okay. 
What what's happening? <sighs> okay, Karokan. Let's let's lose every game we play. That's that's my strategy. Let's see how many games we can lose today. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna try and crassle crassle? We're gonna try and crassle Cream Shride. Um This feels fairly uncomfortable. Um, I can always come up here and take back. I don't really like this move. We're just gonna do this because fuck that. That's just not a smart move. <sighs> it's just not. It's just not a smart move. I mean, look. What is, what is homie up to? What are these wild and crazy maneuvers that I'm, I'm seeing right now? Homie's up to some wild shit. It feels like he's going real hard. Um... I think we just force him to do it or move. And now he's got to move. What is what is this guy doing? I okay. Okay. I mean, I just take this all day. Yeah, uh, I mean, I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't know what was happening. Uh, that felt weird. I, I mean, I guess I finally played someone who was lower ranked than me. Um, we're still angry, we're still angry as fuck. But I mean, <laughs> we'll take the win. <laughs> I gotta pee. I mean, one second. All right, we're back to playing some mediocre chess. Um, sorry, I. Uh, um, yeah, I drink a shit ton of water, especially lately. Not even intentionally. I just really like sparkling water, and we started using uh, Soda Stream again, and uh, I have some sparkling water out the ass now just unlimited sparkling water so i just drink it because it's because it's delicious i just really like sparkling water. <laughs> that sounds really weird just takes the queen i put my knight here i 
always call this like the white scandy defense like the white scandy defense of like the of the sicilian it's so bizarre so it's, it's a weird move order i'm not sure what the intention is it just feels like you're moving a whole bunch of times to not accomplish a lot um and i don't i don't get it i don't get why we're why we're moving so much to do so little <clears throat> um okay we're here we're good yeah that's fine in fact i think we just move here so we can attack it well yeah no it's only got one defender right now Yeah, we take the pawn, we take the knight. I mean, if that's the case, then we just take this knight, and that's okay with me. We have no complaints. Uh, probably want to push our rook over. This is currently trapped. I think I would give up this bishop if I could take the pawn and the rook. Um, we'll see if he lets us do it. I really don't know. We'll have to see. If he doesn't move his knight this turn, I mean... Yeah, okay, there we go. That's more along the lines of what's expected. Um, I think we start lining this up. <clears throat> but we need to push this out. Um, if we move our we move our queen, then they win a pawn here. Um, so I want to push this up and out. Well, ideally, we'd push him away. Maybe even follow it with this. Other than that. But. Yeah, I mean, he's trying to get me off of this line, and I just don't. I think, like. This is going to be far more effective. He can't come here right now, so he's forced to go there. Just doesn't do much for him. Um, so now we can either push him out, uh, which isn't the worst thing. Um, or we can just get into this position here. You know what, actually, I kind of like this position. Um, it allows us to then push this and move the queen and still defend everything. But frankly, I, it also, this also gets us off the line of the rook, which I think is a good thing. Um, frankly, I still feel like this is a good move right now. Um, or maybe we even this into this, right? I don't know what this does. He's like over attacking this pawn, but I can just... Like, move this, and the queen is pinned. The next turn, if he doesn't move his queen, we just move this. Um...
I don't know what this does. I wish that I did. Um... We always have this position where we can threaten mate. Um, he comes in here to try to win the pawn. We push the knight out and he can't move the knight. Um, so we win the night. <clears throat> this would be a safe, or sorry, this would be a safe move right now, right? That doesn't do it. He's still... This is a legitimate mate threat. The best he can do is check, take, 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 take. But then he has to do this, and I, I don't know... what he wins at that point. He doesn't even win a pawn, he just trades a bunch of shit. <clears throat> yeah. In fact, I don't even have to do it that way. I just go like this. And like this. Does he, I mean, he's got to see this, yeah? Like, he has to. It's very obvious. Okay, there we go. Now I feel like we go like this. <clears throat> um, it's not really much point to that. Wait, what? Okay, if I take and he takes, where does that leave us? I'm happy to take and let him take, and then I would push this, and then he's got to do something. All right, he has to take with this pawn. And I take back. This feels positive for me. Because we're still in a mate threat, right? This is still a mate threat. He needs to handle this. He cannot take here. And if he doesn't take here, I will take here. Oh, then he is wide open. I mean, wide open. 
And then we start pushing this pawn. I, I'm not sure. I, I think he's in a bad position. I think we're actually okay. Um, I think we've found ourselves into like a somewhat good position after our awful 0-4 start. <laughs> um, I don't... He, he's got a pseudo threat here. So we might as well handle it. Is this a threat? No. Why would that be a threat? Is this a threat? No. No. The only threat he really has here is this. So he might as well just move it up so he doesn't take the pawn. <laughs> Easy peasy. He still cannot take this. He cannot move this. This pawn is frozen. Yeah, that's not a that's not a problem. We don't care about that at all. He can't come here. Okay, interesting. But like not really. Frankly, I could have done, I could have checked and taken. I should have, and I'm stupid for not seeing that. Um. I gave him the ability to trade queens, which I didn't have to do. Um, but I do want to protect this pawn. He's really trying. There's no more checks. <clears throat> and I win a piece in a second. I kind of want to check and come over here. We're up a piece. I should be trying to trade queens. The main threat was was nice and fun, but but like realistically, it didn't help us. Let's time to move on. Greener pastures. Greener pastures. We're not chasing a mate threat anymore. I missed the winning this piece when I had the opportunity, and that sucks. Um, I That's a weird... Okay, that's not what I wanted or cared about. Yeah, I, I, I just win this. I just win this.
we're not stressed. I actually want him to do this. Because now the game's over. This is all completely protected. We just happily take everything. None of it matters. <clears throat> Wants to rematch? Um, sure. Oh, wow, he's spamming rematch, so he's not happy. Um, we'll take it. We're we're a little bit we're like slightly less angry or or this angry. Um yeah. No, we're okay. We're good. That was not so bad. That could have been a hell of a lot worse. We're making we're making a a comeback <laughs> to sanity. We're playing Italian. This is what I usually play. Make a uh <laughs> A push back into the real world. Okay. Gyoko Piano. We'll do the same thing. Um, okay. It's interesting. Um, all right, so I am not a big fan of this night. I'd much rather get rid of it. This night causes me heartburn. Happy to trade it. That's not a problem for me. Um... He's got three things attacking this, though. But if I move it, it's worse. Yeah, if I move this, in theory, he just takes this. And even if we take that, he takes our... yeah. Well, hold on, actually. No, no, no. If I move it and he takes this, we just go here. And then he still has to move. Yeah, but actually, then he has me. <laughs> oh, no, he doesn't, because we're blocking it. So this is still kind of what we want to do. I'm still kind of on board with this. On board. He can win this pawn, and that's about it. I move here. Then he has to move his knight. Yep. That's okay. I think we're okay with this in general. Um, I mean, that's a move. I 
I feel like he's trying to set up mate, right? We take this, he takes it with his queen, and we just move our rook back. If he takes it with our bishop, we actually want to move this out of the way. Yeah. Okay. It's fine. We're totally fine. We're just chilling. I'm just trying to be chill. Just trying to be chill. Everything's good. We're not going to stress. I don't really want to queen trade. Um, all right. So we're able to move back to a more reasonable position. And in this position, I feel like we can get our rook back over here. I don't know what that does. That's a weird move for me. Okay, so he's trying to prevent me capturing this back. Got it. Yeah, if he wants to do that, we'll just take, we'll move, we'll come protect. We'll come protect. This has been hanging for a while now, and somehow I didn't see it. So that's super good to know. I'd like to get my queen here, if that makes any difference. Um, but it might be too late because this is actually a really dangerous move. Yep. Though, to be fair, I'm okay with this maneuver. Um, because I can bring another rook over here. Enforce a trade. And just sort of liquidate our queens, liquidate our board. He's got two pawns on me. It's not like the end of the world. It's not ideal. Um, this is definitely not an ideal situation. I'm not thrilled about it. I made a couple of weird moves that I wish I hadn't. Um, but, uh... Yeah, there's not a whole lot I can do about it at this point, right? I can also move this um, bishop down and just threaten to just take. Yeah, so we're going to do this. At this point, I feel like, wait, that's a terrible move. That's a terrible move. Fuck. I just lost the game. That's like so unfortunate that I'm not dumb. It's so unfortunate that I'm this stupid. <sighs> I said it before, it's really hard. It's really hard being stupid. <laughs> like really hard. Very, very hard. We just throw our pieces away. If they don't matter. Because apparently they don't. Oh my god! Did I... Okay, this is what happens when I'm, when I'm already tilted.
I am I am so tilted. That's so embarrassing. Fuck, we're angry. Yeah, good game. Okay. I'm so angry right now. Like, I'm smiling, <laughs> but I like want to kill somebody. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, that was stupid. Oh. My God. I, uh, this is fine. Yeah, this is a basket fire, a dumpster fire, the worst kinds of fire. And it was all like not fine at all. Um, in the slightest. So, yeah, we're going to go like this and just kind of prevent um, this nonsense. Because fuck that. That's stupid. Um, this is the only place he can really go, unless he's pushing here to go here. Or he's just like randomly developing. Might be true. Either way, I'm just going to castle. So it gives my knight a place to go if I have to. But that's just a free pawn. He literally can't take. And now he has to move his knight. That was weird. Um, to be honest. This is a somewhat dangerous spot for me. I don't really want to push him out. Um... I don't want him to take this pawn either, so. Fuck him. Yeah, I mean, I don't like this spot, but again, I also still don't really know what it does, right? He can do this. Okay, so he's back to, to this, except Actually, no, it is really dangerous. I was right the first time when I thought it was dangerous. Um, all right, so here's the thing. If I'm here, and he takes and pushes me away and moves back. And he takes it, comes again, then I'm in trouble. But like at this exact moment, I'm not exactly in trouble. I'm wondering what my choices are to make this less dangerous. If I come here, I don't know that anything he can do can actually get me. So I don't know if there's anything I care about here. He might just take this pawn, I'll just let him take the pawn and I won't care. Right, he, he can draw, and that's fine. Um, I think we're just going to push this out and get our bishop out. We're just not going to think about it. Because there really is no point in, in worrying about whatever nonsense he's going to do here. Like, actually none. There is zero point. He can't really move his knight out right now, which is the funny thing. Oh. Okay. I mean... Okay. I'm still like trying to see the threat and I just don't I guess I lose a rook right 
I lose the exchange, is what happens. Okay. Then he goes back, up, and this happens. Okay. I lost a, a rook in an exchange, or a, a pawn in an exchange. Which sucks, but you know, what are you gonna do? Defend an attack here. Hmm. It's kind of gross. I mean, we're only down an exchange. It's not like we're, it's not like we've lost the game. Um, I'm trying to, I'm trying to understand. I'm trying to figure out the best way to like navigate this. That's not good. I mean, I'm not, this isn't the worst thing that's ever existed. If I take, if I take this, I'm assuming he's taking here. I wonder if he sees, okay, if I move this off, I mean, right now we're, we're like kind of lining up this. Um, I have a feeling he's just gonna take here and force a queen trade, which is totally okay. Um, it doesn't necessarily force a queen trade, but it, I mean, because I can technically go here, but um, I don't know what my benefit of that is. But any non-move by his queen or king, oh, he, is not in a good place right now and he's going to be very unhappy that is an unhappy moment that is an unhappy moment for sure i'm still down or no i'm, I'm slightly up technically i mean when he takes this i'll be slightly more up um But, uh, man, that can't feel good. <sighs> okay, so that was our little comeback moment. We're happy. I will 100% go down to uh, queen and bishop versus bishop and rook. 
I don't know why I would ever do that. I mean, he's just playing hope chess. I'm hoping I'm not going to see things now. I mean, at this point, I can just check. Um, and start getting aggressive. If I go here, what are his choices? Why would I go there? I go here to push this rook off, but like, do I care that this rook is pushed off? Not really. You can go like this and pin the rook. That doesn't help me though. I feel like that move was, was stupid. I can pin the rook and that does help me if I'm gonna go here. Right. I can pin the rook and try and trap it. Like, if the king doesn't move, he's lost the rook. <clears throat> okay, so he lost the rook. I don't, I don't know. He keeps making these weird moves, man, and I don't understand. We're not even going to go... I thought we were trading, trading rook for rook. We're not. We're just taking rooks. That's that's a really dumb move. Okay. Um, still have to play this smart. We're, we're down a lot of pawns. So we need to be able to stop basically all of his pawns. I don't really want to let this pawn down. I want to keep this as a two. Um, so I feel like we can manage that. This is okay, actually. It's not okay to go that way. Yeah, again, this just feels weird. Oh no, you're dumb. We're still up a rook, but this is really bad. You're so dumb. So dumb. It's actually kind of wild. So I'm going to take this whole side, which is nice. I'm literally a, a rook and a bishop, which is not bad. I have to protect this pawn for sure, without a doubt. Um... I think you have to go like this, and then is this mate? No, not yet. Oh, I have to get out.
Hmm. We're not protecting that pawn right now. But that was really stupid. Now we win. The game's over. That was a dumb mistake. Because we can we can just free move these. And then here, and then here. Right, and now we just win the game. If we can remember how to... <laughs> if we can remember how to... Um... <laughs> how to do it, then yeah. We know how to do it. I'm not being uh, idiotic. Come on, you're going to make me go all the way? <laughs> Can I do this the whole time? Oh man, people. People. It's mate. It's mate. He's gonna sit here? Okay. He wait. Wait, wait, wait. So so homeboy literally made me do every single piece of this. Just to prove I could do it. Um And then when I <laughs> and then when I got to the corner, he's like Nah. Nah, I'm not gonna let you mate me. Alright. Alright. <laughs> I guess we're okay. I guess we're okay. I guess we're okay. Man, I don't even know what to say. I don't even know what to say sometimes. People are wild. Alright. We're three and five. We're we're trying to salvage the session is what we're trying to do. We're trying we're trying to salvage the session. And be like maybe break even would be awesome at this point. Carolcon. Alright. We're gonna play fantasy. I'm assuming he's playing the Carolcon. Yeah, okay. I haven't played the advanced in a while, but most people are really good at the advanced on black and it's just kind of a pain in the ass. I just don't like, I don't like playing again. Oh, yeah, this is the most challenging move, so nice. Um, we'll just go here. <clears throat> Probably could have gone here. Maybe should have gone there, realistically. Um, we'll do this if we have to. Yeah. What I expected. Um. Let's see. He comes here. We don't really have anything besides moving to this spot. But well, that's something, right? But then he just goes over here, and it just gets ugly and gross and weird. Um, how else do we fend this, though? Like, that's the question. That's a normal, just a normal developing move? No, let's not think about that. Let's, let's only think about wild, crazy things. Okay, fine, got it. <sighs> um...
Yeah, I don't really want to be pinned here. Um, no! This is what I just did. And he didn't see it. Holy Christ. Somehow, that didn't occur to him. Wild and shocking. I gave away a knight. And uh, he just let me. He just straight was like, okay. Okay, that's fine. You can give away a knight. Um... Yeah. If he takes and I take, he takes. I just move, right? What's maybe the smartest way of doing it? kind of just want to do this. Um, it never lets him take this piece. I'm going to take this pawn. Oh no, he can take the pawn now. Fuck, what am I thinking? It's hard to be dumb. It's hard to be dumb. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. What kind of threats can we get going on? That might be interesting. <laughs> can we do anything that's fun? Or are we just kind of fucked? I'm sure we can and I'm just not, my brain's just not functional. So right now, he takes, we take, he takes, we take, he takes. So we're just, we're just gonna play this game, I guess. I don't know why, but we are. Oh, he's kind of got to move that. I mean, if he doesn't do anything, we probably just castle next. We wanted to castle this side anyway. Um, he's very undeveloped. Oh, that's not, that can't be good, right? Hold on, if I take here, what can he do that's even threatening? If he takes, we just take. Ooh, shit. No, he takes and we have to play with the pawn so we don't get trapped. No, that's not a threat. If we take, and he takes and we take, and he comes over here to pin us to the, the king, then we just take. And he loses it because he's not developed. I think he just loses a piece. I might be wrong. You know, don't rely on me, but um, I've certainly made my fair share of dumbass moves. But this does not feel scary. Because now this covers this just fine. <clears throat> and he really has no way in with this rook. It's, it's, it's kind of pointless. It's a stupid looking rook. Why don't we just say, like, get the fuck out? Well, 
What you doing? And then we castle. And we say, what you doing? Saying a lot of what you doing. That's what we're doing. The thing is, he's just not developed at all. Like, this is terrible for him. It's awful. I mean, I'm not like chess genius, but like, it's just a bad fucking idea to have all your pieces doing nothing. This just gives away a piece. Like, I, I'm really struggling to understand this move right now. Is he desperately trying to get developed? I don't know. But this is a free piece. I do know that. Okay, if he gets this in here, what does that even do? Like, I can't move this way. But there's no immediate threats. We just take this piece and we profit. Because that's dumb. He's giving away two pieces now. I'm, I'm not going to... I'm not going to start questioning it like crazy. <clears throat> I'm just going to take the pieces and not care. Okay. Now, the one thing I need to do is not turn into him. Where I have like, where I create my own problems. By not being developed. This is not a great place for this to be, but I think even worse maybe is how undeveloped I am. He wants to come here, yeah? Right? He wants to come there. Okay, so if I come here and he comes here, I can just go here and say, okay, you take me, I take you. That's fun. We're up two pieces. Yeah. I did just kind of trap my rook, actually, now that I look at it. And that sucks. That's a sucky feeling. Um, if I'm here, this is covered, this is covered, this is covered, this is covered, and this is covered. His only move is really here. We have to move here. If I come here and he moves here. I feel like I just... Go this way. That feels unnecessarily dangerous. So does this, honestly, but I actually kind of like that move, <laughs> as weird as that is. But we can just not be dumb. There's no reason we can't just move. There's no reason we can't just move. I, I will way overthought of it. Next video. I got away with it. Brilliant move. Yeah. Not really. Um, it was an awful move. I got away with it because he didn't see it. And it was really stupid looking. Ugh, man. He's just super after my queen. Which. I, I mean that's fine. 
That's fine. It's okay. Everybody's okay, guys. Everybody's okay. Um... Okay. I mean, even if we have to sack this for a bishop or something, it doesn't feel like the end of the world. I think at this point we just play this, right? He can't take with the queen. He has to take with that. And now I come here. Queen has to move. Then we can take this. We've now stabilized. We're totally good. Everything is A-OK. -okay. Even this move does not matter. We actually just come up here. We're totally fine. This is covered, so we have no threats. Um, actually, this is a, this is a fork. Um, yeah, we're just going to fork that. You can't hear me? Like, at all? What do you mean you can't hear me? Can you please explain that better? What does that mean? If I come here... That's a fork. Okay. Ads go every 30 minutes. Okay, that's good. Can you really not? Oh, you can't hear me because you are you have ads. Got it. You can't hear me because you have ads. I'm running out of time. I'm doing well, but I'm running out of time. This is force of queen's tra forces of queen trade. Okay. Now we push. That'll save us a bunch of time. And he checkmated himself on my pre-moves. Okay. Four and five. Are you back? Let me know when you're back. Because I, I, I hate that ads run, but I really also hate pre-roll ads. So I don't know what's worse. So come back and let's talk about it when you're back. I do want to chat about it. Anyone else in chat who wants to talk about it and how you feel about ads and the ad experience in this channel, please let me know because I really fucking hate pre-roll ads. Um, I feel like it, it just like kills people who want to play 
New people who want to come and join. Ads broke. Oh, good old Twitch. Oh, that's just a mobile app. Okay. I was going to say fucking good old Twitch being a piece of shit. That's nice of them. Yeah, we'll take that happily. Um, and... Uh, I think we just, I think realistically we take this, right? Am I wrong? I think we take this. And then, and then we set up a wall. I can actually just come in here. That's kind of frustrating. We're like in a really good spot. Um, we kind of want to take this. Okay, he kept us from doing so. That's fine. Um, I think we can just castle here, so we don't have any any problems. Okay, so tell me, since you're back, Infernos, 30 minutes of ads. Or, sorry, not 30 minutes of ads. Ads every 30 minutes, which it's supposed to do, I think. I think that was what it said it was going to do. So that's like a good thing. Um, insofar as it's doing what I what I wanted it to do. As every 30 minutes versus pre-roll ads. How do they how do they stand up for you? How do they stack up for you? Stand up? That's weird. Um I need to move this out. Thirty minutes dead. Okay. Can we be like a little bit more? Thirty minutes probably better used to them on mobile. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out like you know how they how they are comparatively to. Yeah, pre-roll deters new viewers, and that sucks. I hate that. I literally fucking hate that. Um, my actual least favorite thing about <laughs> Twitch's bullshit is their pre-roll ads. I kind of want to take, but I know that's really dumb. I know there's not a reason for it. Um, kind of also just want to go like this, but I don't want them to take there. So I feel like I have to push this, which I don't really want to do. No, this gives him this. See, this is why I don't want to do things. Because my brain doesn't work like a normal human. So, literally giving him a, a pawn with tempo, which is the worst. Yeah. The good news is it's not like all bad. Um, taking this allows him to take here. And then we would trade off. But then I could win this pawn. It's not, it's not the end of the world actually. I actually kind of like that. He takes here, I take here. I go rook here. He has to move, and I take here. 
And then I can move back and threaten these pawns. Yeah, I feel like pre-roll ads make people more likely to go elsewhere. For sure. Oh, well, I am just stupid. Um, the only good thing about what's happening right now is that I can pin him, but it's not even really pinning because this is covering. <sighs> so how do we feel about this? All right, so he is his his queen is pinned right now, without a doubt. If we move our rook over, we're actually in not a bad spot. The same way I feel about. <laughs> well, fair enough. All right, so this is fine. I mean, I think he's actually in a bad spot. He's gonna move, well, no, this wins. This is just winning, because I win his knight and he does not win my bishop. That's actually really good. We just won a piece. That was a... Very big mistake. But now I'm feeling like I just want to simplify things. Okay. There's no threat here, so I'm not really worried about it. If he comes here to try to trap me, I'm just going to move here, kick him out. I can actually kick him out right now. Just... If he comes here to trap me, he actually loses his bishop, so that's... Yeah. That's not a threat. Um, that's, <laughs> okay. All right. Um, now I'm just gonna try and take his bishop. I'm gonna come here. And I'll take this and trade. I'm happy with that trade. Um, this is safe. So, it's okay, but I'm gonna move my bishop, or my... My, my rook anyway. I can use the words. I can say the words. What does that do? What's happening? What's happening? Okay, we're gonna lock that in place. That gives up a piece. Well, this would give up a piece for a piece, right? And then this, my piece would come with tempo. So that's not the, the worst thing, right? And then he has to move probably there. And I come back and it's more tempo. Like he has to come back. Actually, I like it because I, if I come here and he takes and I take, he's going to have to move and I can take this pawn. And then he's going to have to move back anyway because he still has to defend this pawn. I can just start chomping up all the pawns. He's doing it? Who's doing it? I'm doing it. Okay. This is probably a safer move than just all of that nonsense. Just to force him to move off. Okay. 
Okay. So I can move back here, and I guess, oh, that's, that's not good. Hmm. I feel like there's a punish somewhere, and I'm not sure where. I can just take. Well, then he has to take, or else he just loses a, a piece. He can move this way now, but then I come over here and I push him back. Okay. Take, he takes, I cannot take back. And now is the real, uh, the real sad face. Because he either moves this like back here or down here. Well, down there doesn't work. No, we take this and double his pawns. And then we take this. He can't even take it. That's a super sad face. That's a super sad face. His face is super sad. We can just take this next. GG. He says GG, so I said GG back. I know it's off screen. All right. All right, we managed to pull this dumpster fire out of the complete fire. <laughs> It was a complete dumpster fire. And now it's just, um, oh, I'm still at my calendar and see what I'm doing. Okay. It's not a, it's not a complete fire. We're, I think we're, we're off of wild rage into just like regular rage. Winning when you came in, Infernos. <laughs> yeah, winning when you came in. Um, awesome. We're going to keep playing in a minute. Um, I'm going to take a quick break. I have to pee again. And like I said, I drink a ton of water. Um, if you're having fun, follow the stream. I'd appreciate it. It's awesome. Um, also, it would be a good way to test my alerts button because I've been trying to fix it forever. So if you throw me a follow or something, my alerts should go off. And if they don't, it's, uh, that's on me. Um, uh, anyway, otherwise, um, I'll be back in like literally a minute again. Oh fuck, I am using the old break screen. Damn. That's uh that's unfortunate. <clears throat> um I guess that's I just haven't updated that one yet. Sorry, there's been a lot of stuff I've been doing. I've been like trying to add stuff to YouTube and like, you know, do other shit and it's a lot. Alright. Let's try and go winning now. We're we're gonna go for it. I know it sounds crazy to have a winning record after being 0-4, but we are going to um, <coughs> then give it the old college try here. If we get into the winning record, I, I feel like well, the winning record zone, I feel like we may um, we may paint for a little bit before we close out. Um, okay, this is pretty pretty standard. It's a style that I don't quite understand, but a lot of people use. Um, Thank you. 
All right, so this is attacking our bishop. Yeah, I mean, moving back is the only real option. We can go here, but he just so easily kicks us to this spot with here, and then um, he takes us. And I don't, I don't mind this, but I do mind this. Um, okay. I guess. I mean, this is this pawn's covered, and realistically, the goal was to do this. I guess it's not um, good anymore, right? Because I come here, he takes, I take, he takes, I take, he takes, and I can't, I can't take back. So, I think what we really want to do is actually just kick kick this bishop if we can. Or pff, kick this knight. I'm thinking about it because I have this bishop here. Yeah, I can't do anything about that, so. Um, it's just not changing. Okay. That's weird. I'm not, I'm not going to lie about that. That's like a very weird, a very weird decision. Okay. Also, super weird. Like, now he's just down a piece. I mean, he has two pawns that I didn't have. But, like, what just happened? Now he wants to, tr now he wants to trade my knight, my rook? Uh, call me confused. Because I am, for sure. Okay, if I go here, he has this. Um, I actually, I have to move this off. I have to do something with this. I can go there. I'm not thrilled about it. Maybe we just go like this. I mean, we're up a piece. This can't be bad. I just have to not be retarded. I'm sorry. I shouldn't say that. I have to not be... I have to not make really dumb mistakes that I can avoid. I have to not make avoidable mistakes. For sure. This, I would love to take. And just double his pawns this way. Um, if he takes it, I don't mind so much because we block this sort of mid, mid pawn. And then we have two versus three over here. Um, Susk. Yeah. I, it's not... It wasn't intentional. There's nothing meant by it. I... Uh, my bad, homie. Um, if we take this, he has to take us back. Um, because if he goes here, we, we take this. Susk was to the weird move. Uh, this move or my move? Which move was weird? Oh, back here? Like all the way back here? Good question, I was only listening. <laughs> I love it. Okay. 
Yeah, he can't take this because there's no threat here, but there's a threat here. Nope, 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 nope. You did that wrong. Nope. You don't get to do that. This guy is like very bad at calculating. Um, oh my gosh. You're just going to let me trade off all of your stuff now. Okay. I'm so happy to just trade all your things off. Literally, literally just, just whatever was left of the game, he just like gave it away. So to be fair, to be fair, my first four games were really bad, <laughs> really bad today. I was not awake. My first game, I think I gave away a bishop and a queen back to back for free, uncontested. Um, while my brain was still off, so how do uh, maybe he's just asleep? Maybe he's just very tired. Who knows? Well, I'm gonna be nice. All right, six and five. We're even like calming down from from here, from this level. We're just like regular gecko right now. Our stress, our anger level is just regular gecko, which is impressive. Um. Okay, we'll play one more game. Keep in mind, this is our, our highest rank to date. We started at 1151? Oh, maybe we're at the exact same. I think we're... No, 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 we're higher than we were. We're 1151. Let's play one more game. The fateful one more game where I lose and uh, get really frustrated. That's That's the way it always goes. And then I think... If we win this game, we uh, we definitely we definitely use some painting afterwards. All right, pretty standard opening for the Sicilian. Um, okay. <laughs> win this game, it was all me. Yeah, I mean to be fair, you did kind of like. Enter and just start. We just start. I just started winning. So, you know, I'm not going to lie. That happened as much as I don't want to admit it. It did happen. He needs something to defend this pawn. Probably knight. Yep. Um, castling makes sense. feel like he's immediately going to push this. Why do I feel like he's just coming hard? I'm just getting that feeling from him. Eh, just a single. That's okay. I think he was doing that to take away this space when he comes here. So this is my assumption is what he's going to do. Um, I'm going to handle that by going by opening this up. And I'll come back here. Or probably the first thing I'll do is I'll take. If he takes, I'll come back here. Um, to avoid this immediate queen, queen nonsense. Okay. Maybe he just didn't want me to come here and threaten his bishop. That's totally reasonable. Um, I am going to push out and push his bishop back. Um, ooh, interesting. We will go here. <clears throat> the idea was when this is here, if uh, if I go here and he takes and I take back, he can take this and it's being blocked by this. I can't take back. Um, but now I can. And I don't care. So if he wants to do that, he is more than welcome. I mean, he can just take this. It's fine. Um, I 
Adds right on 30 minutes again. Okay, cool. Good to know. Um... I feel like... I really want to move my knight, but there's no there's no there's no point to it. I don't get anything out of it. Like I can move my knight here. This is actually not bad. Seems a little crazy. Cause it is. But if I move my knight here, I can come here on threaten to take. And if he takes, I can take. And if I move here and he takes, I can take. <clears throat> and I know he can set up some awkward situations, but I guess he just chose to just do it that way. And I'm just going to take this way anyway, to be honest. Um... Because I'd love to come in here and threaten this bishop. So ads on 30 minutes. 90 second ads every 30 minutes. I hope that's not like super annoying. This doesn't just threaten the bishop either. This technically threatens this pawn and the bishop. Okay, so... We're gonna go like this. And still threaten the bishop. Because F that bishop, man. F it. Yeah, we kind of saw that one coming. Yeah, it should be 90 seconds. This is a dangerous move. Um, yep. It's not like end of the world dangerous, but it's not good. I can always move here. This is probably my best move. This sucks? But does it? <clears throat> Trying to decide what we take back with. How dumb is this? On a scale of one to dumb. How dumb? Like, pretty dumb, yeah? No, it's not that dumb. I don't know that he can actually punish it, to be honest. I'm not actually sure he can punish it.
On a scale of one to dumb, it's probably pretty dumb. I'm potentially getting my queen into, into trouble. And I really don't like that. But it is not ultimate dumb. I feel like I can open things up by bringing my knight here. Um, interesting decision. I'm happy to trade off one pair of rooks. I don't know that I'm going to actually get the opportunity to do so. This will certainly help, though. This is basically just a rook fork. And I don't think there's anything you can do about it. Why is he trying to trade off? Pieces. Oh, I have to, I, he forces a queen trade, right? If I do anything else, I lose this piece. Well, hold on, hold on, this isn't true. Wait, yes it is. He needs to take like, no, he needs to take like this. He doesn't have a choice. If he takes like this, then this forks the rooks. And he's fucked. Um... So assuming he takes like this, this is still covered. This has to, oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. No, no, no. No, 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 no. That's not how this works. Because I can just trade this back. That's fine. And now you have to move your, now you have to move your knight. And I win this. Yeah. That's, it seemed pretty... I thought it was pretty clear what was going to happen there. Um, we take this pawn. And... You see if he wants to trade with us. Oh, he doesn't even care about the pawn. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. I mean, we're going here next move, almost no matter what, except for that. <laughs> That's pretty much the only thing. Or... Okay. And we're really just going here so we can trade off this knight. So we have a knight, knight and rook versus knight. Um... Uh, we can hit this, but that doesn't get us anywhere. So we're just going to do this, because we want to trade this night, this night off. Very badly we want so. Very badly. Oh yeah, thank you. Please let me do it. Please let me do it with no consequences. I appreciate it. Now we force this guy out of here. And come here. Unless he's there. And we'll come here. Okay, that's fine. Um, I 
I think we just need to start start making pawns making pawns move. This king is stuck. He's gonna have to move this first. Um, which is okay. It's fine by me. He moves this down, I just move this up. His king is still stuck. Um, and then we come over here. Or we can just keep kicking this knight around and getting ourselves in a better positions. <clears throat> I think we're, I, I mean, this is, this should be unlosable. Okay, we lock him out. Um, he can't get in, so if I come back here, he's got to move up. Completely locked out. Um, so check, go away. I move here. Now I come here. And we start gobbling. Yeah. Cool. Nice games. Okay, so we added seven and five. I did not, honestly, like that's kind of poggers. I'm, uh, I'm not gonna lie. Or, or, or gecko, gecko C. Emote in the chat. No, it doesn't work. Oh, because it's lowercase. God, I'm retarded. I'm <laughs> really bad. No, why is it still? Why is he still a white background on a on dark mode? Infernos, this is your fault. This is your fault. What is wrong? He still has white background. Yes, your fault. What do you mean? You made it. You gave me a PNG. Are the current ones up to date? So I can submit the current one and get it fixed. Okay. I'm assuming that's what you're saying. In which case, Okay. All right. I'll 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 I'll, I'll take your word for it for now. <laughs> All right, guys. If you were just here for chess, thank you so much. I appreciate it. This was this turned out um, better than I thought this morning when I was like not in a good mood. I'm gonna keep streaming, but I'm gonna be streaming some uh, some painting. So.